Alright, I think we should all be buffed up. Actual ready check full. Remember, don't go too ape shit on the start. I know we have tribute or Darkman Fair and all that kind of shit, but uh, wait until you get your spore to go crazy, because otherwise you'll probably rip that and die. Angelise just got DC again. Okay. Let me know when you're back in, Angelise, and I'll probably go once you're back. What healer is Victor's dad on his alt if you um if you want another one? He's well, okay, he's really far away, never mind. I'll just wait for him to get here later. Make sure you look what spore groups you're in. Healers, make sure you're listening to the call for which one's next. Don't just go willy nilly. Someone give Scrooge a mite. Angelis, you loaded in? Yeah, let's go. Alrighty, Rodin, give me a PI. Everyone should move up close to the door. And we're going in three, two, one, let's go. Ashley, you're first. Remember, Black, sure nice and slow to start here. We're waiting for your Spores support. back, right? Group one. Yutari. Group two is for his front right. Rodin. Recurse. Front right again, group three. Nephi, then Zuniat. Group four. Zuniat. Uh, Gumpy, then Tumpies. Group 5. Recurse. Recurse Warlocks. Dr. Jekyll. Last stand is gonna wear off here, so I'm gonna lose the HP. We're good. One. Uh, Ashley. Curse of Elements on the boss, please. Recurse. The next Paladin that gets called, go ahead and give me a Lay on Hands. Group 2. That would be Wallace. Yep. You can just hit me with it now. Rodin. Group 3. Some of you are a little too close to the sport. So Rodin and Nephi. And Curse, group four. Nephi. Zuniat. Group five. Remember after this next demise, you'll go bandage yourself and repop Shadow Pot if you didn't. Beat six. Be curse. Doctor Jekyll. Then Holy Snake. If you need to move away, bandage yourself, pop another shadow. It's group one. Oh, right, Fashley. Fashley. And Iatari. Group two. Tari and then Wallace. Dream. Uh, Rodin, Effie. Group four. I'm gonna just stay on boss at this point. 
Make sure you're gonna live this last impending doom here. Uh, as soon as you got thing, Gumpy. Boss did. Good job, guys. Nice rain. Yep. And we can nice head rain. to Gothic's room. I forgot to put on my stones. I had no poisons on my stones. Hey, Scrooge. Congrats. That was his SR. All right, this is open for casters. Locks, those are uh, good if you don't want to get the legs off Thaddeus. The Thaddeus legs are way better, but still. All right, on a Pippi, congrats. And these for Ewok only, he's not here, so they are open. Uh, can you open those again and actually pass? I thought you said Ewok. Can I keep my roll? I mean, he went major, so yeah, it doesn't matter what you roll. Oh, okay. Never mind. Congrats, Eric. Just remember that when it comes to four horsemen, okay? Lasers, Papa Tick, the person you were telling me about. Yeah, that's my dad. Okay. Uh, Papa, you're gonna be on live side for Gothic. Pop an arcane protection potion. If you're on dead side. Yeah, uh, open trade with a lock again for a health stone if you need a health stone for this fight, which you probably do. If you haven't already dead side, give me an arcane protection potion. Make sure you're nice and healthy. If you're not sure which side you're going, if you're new, if you're melee DPS, you're going dead. If you're a caster, you're going live. See how we're looking. All right, everyone ready to. Remember, dead side, don't outrange your healers. Checking to make sure you're on your toes. Is it a <laughs> job? I wouldn't have been on my toes with aspect on. You Good job, Good job then. Oh, 
anyone else tired tonight? Nope. Nope. Not at all. I stopped going to bed at 5 a.m. Oh, it's a lot. Here. Yeah, it's a lot later than 5 a.m. I'm going to bed now. <laughs> I'm lucky. It was a, it was a 9 a.m. for me. Yeah. Yep. I, I'm usually going to bed around 9 or 10 a.m. lately. No, mainly don't go too far. The first kill goes to me. I, I, don't, I don't know what's going on, man. All right, first wave of knights coming live side. Now they're coming dead side. Make sure they get picked up, uh, Scrooge and Phylexi or Domber especially. Do your, like, the more tanky individuals on that side. Dead side, stay back. More knights coming dead. Remember, C trainee, kill trainee, dead side. Press knights are settable. Yep, disarm each other. Everything's dying so fast, I can't even get rage. I'll get the center up. Right. You guys got two more knights coming dead side and a rider shortly after. Uh, Rodin, you Stunable. will shackle the next knight that spawns on that side of the room, okay? On Thadium side. It won't be this wave, but next. This is just trainees plus right. So this next wave is spawning in three, you'll shackle. Thadium, just let him shackle. Get stunned. So you'll keep star from now on. Next wave of trainees, Gumpy, you will shackle. And you guys will just keep those things shackled, number one priority. I think it's somewhat. This wave coming now. That mm -hmm. is shackable, square. Or circle. Man. Last wave for life side here. Dead side, repop arcane if you need to. Just stay healthy. I'm stunned, I can't back up the running. Dead next first slide. We Gucci. Finish these. Just leave the shackles. Don't touch them. You can keep them perma shackled. <laughs> Was that a half second Broke later? Broke clutch a threat. Soldiering. Uh, dead side. You guys okay? Looking clear? Yeah, we're fine. All right, good. Almost Freddy, explain yourself. We did too much Freddy? damage. Sorry. Get this man up. Daddy G. Kill him before he goes to dead, because it would be funny. I don't think if only. that's uh, possible for us. Vast, uh, that's not the vast majority. Only like technically three extra people are on dead. A lot more damage is on dead though. Oh, cool! We got the bug. We're but bringing him back over, boys. Get fucked. Nice. Alright, uh, fill, fill the defense real quick before we start doing trash the four horsemen. Do they spawn on the other side? I think, yeah. They're stunnable too. Alright, grab some jazz on these. Ah, thanks. And this is open. And if you got something you can pull, go ahead and pull it. 
I don't even know. Is Dreadnought good for DPS? No. no. Fucking horrible. Not even kinda. Alright, off spec. Looks dope as hell, though. Alright, congrats, Ender. Go ahead and suck it. Boom! Look at tank note. Know which one you're tanking. Please grab. Where's the pat? Are there the pats near? No, we're good. One's at like the bottom right now, so I'm just gonna pull these guys quick. Make sure we kill these quick, we'll get a pat. Remember we killed the Death Knight first. It's just now starting to come up the ramp really, so we got a while. Uh Lox, if you like me, try to refill your shards here. Split the uh, lights, please. Here they come. Got the gargoyles back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. I'm pulling them back around the corner. I like how you hit the jump there. It's fun. You're like, hey! Eat up. If you eat, let your healers drink. You can get moving quicker. You got mana buns or health buns? Perhaps. Freddy, what are you I looking? I realized I'm muted. I've been how long have I been muted? Have you guys heard me at all tonight? Nope. Uh, nope. Usually have you muted. Uh, your ah. time, dude. Well, yeah, I'm here. Well, uh, I don't have cinnamon buns. Chill until the gargoyles back up a little bit. You were giving out gear. Give me your buns. Thank you. Yeah, it's just been since trash. Okay. I'm like semi eating because Ross got home really late. So. All her fault. I mean, it is. It's snowing, you know. Tell her to do some lab work from home. Hey, did you like fucking crit everything right there? I think that's resistant, yeah. That's fucking sick, man. Alright, everyone go ahead and move through. If we pull gargoyle or ghouls, we pull ghouls, but hug the wall. Do you want this? Nope. Gargoyles, gargoyles, gargoyles. Oh, Gargoyles, kill Gargoyles, Gargoyles first, cool. Gargoyles first, Gargoyles first, Gargoyles first. Bring them over. Bring them over. Come on. Come Can we on. cross? Come, Should come, we come, cross? Come, come, come. Yes. Just come. Kill Skull first. Pop cooldown. An X. Yes, please give me damage cooldown too. Big ones, big ones. Just live this shit. Like, wreck, fuck it. Out of bubble if you can. Six More goals. We're okay with these. As long as we live the stacks, we're okay with these. Okay. 
I have all the ghouls on me but one. Shield ball's gonna wear off and seven if any tanks can split them up off me. Just keep bumping healers as best you can. Last tick here. Turn what you can. All right, good job recovering from this part. How did you manage that? Weren't they like way up the ramp? Yeah, I don't know, man. People aren't hugging walls. I mean, gotta hug the walls, boys. So they could have to be like right here to pull them where they were. Yeah, I guess we can blame Mission Mishu. Nice try. Sorry, right. won't kill it when it comes. Can we have a rogue distract it? Yep. Yeah, I'll try. while we're recovering. The path all the way up the I don't know. stairs up here. We'll, we'll kill it when it comes. Give it one more distract and then they should be good. Hey, I just want you to know. I know. Go. At least we didn't lose everybody, right? That was an impressive showing of keeping any of us alive there. For real. Yep. And keep me alive. Yeah, I don't know that you're high on the priority list currently. Like the feeling. Mr. Pre AQ gear mostly. This is AQ gear. Some. Uh, five? Oh, all right. Why didn't I remember? You're huge. Huge! Perdition's blade. I don't trust us. My staggers. I mean, to be fair, I came in here with only two pieces from AQ. Yeah, but you're a healer. You still probably have the chest from. We had like no healer drops all of fucking AQ, it felt like. Other than a couple Don Rodriguez. Excuse me, weapons, hello? An AQ? We didn't get shit. We got one scepter and like nothing. Alright, don't go running in like crazy yet. Pop your shadow pot now. We'll, we'll take it nice and slow here. I don't know why I'm marking them. Uh, it is. The same nice. tanks as last week. Uh, we did lose world buffs on a couple of our tanks. Please, please, please make sure we give them extra special attention. And watch your threat.
top left corner. Uh, right, right this way, Dombre. Right at yeah, the just entrance. Just take right as soon as you enter the room. Okay. Instead of looking so at the mini map. Corner right. Oh, that's why I got it wrong. I'm looking at. Okay. Yeah, quit looking at the mini map. No, I'm looking at the map. And Alright, hopefully everyone has a shower protection popped. I'll let us pop a fire too, just cause. Tick, there's a gonna be a fire, and I'm gonna be honest, that wasn't like an attention lapse right there, that was a pet deciding to fucking take stupid pathing. Name on that sheet. Name Xana, just move with that. Uh, you go to below, below first, but then I'm not sure after you move what stack you move on. Uh, we do have less healers this week, so healers, especially when you're at Mograin, make sure new healers are coming in before you leave Mograin, please. We can battle res you to save the pull if you die because you take an extra take too many, but we cannot like battle res save a tank. It fucks everything because the boss runs off and destroys everyone's stacks. It's much more important you just keep the tank alive. You got a shadow and a fire, and like close to a minute on your pot cooldown. Go ahead and hit right. Otherwise, just chill me. Healer assignments should be pretty much the same as they were before on the sheet. Uh, Papa Tick will take over Xana's spot, so he'll start on Blumo and rotate when Xana would. I guess Nodge is missing too. Let me take a look at it. Uh, to start a Mograine instead of placing a Nodger. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Wallace, I don't know if you have the sheet up. Can you tell Tig what stack to rotate at? I know he starts a Bomo, but I'm not sure when he moves. It would be stack three. Got third stack, just go to. Lanigan's here, we can buff him. Which tank do I have he starting on Blam? Is that Chiz? Yeah. Okay. He needs a fort. And prayer shadow. Who does? Lanigan. He just showed up. Yeah, can we get Lanigan? Spot bus, please. Alright, you can go ahead and move into the room. Don't pull the bus. Remember, hug the wall. Alrighty, melee along the side with me here. Go on that. Herbie wants to know which tank is starting on Mogren. Domber. Four, um, Mogren. Gotcha. Let me just pay attention to Ignites. Love the sound of parries at the start of four horsemen. Just keep going hard, boys. Mograin right spot. Yes, sir. Tanks are leaving to go to their spots. Warriors, go ahead and death wish if you didn't already. And wreck now. If you got it up. Three stacks on Mograin. I'm heading in to take Mograin. 
taunting Willis. I've got finish it. Finish Thane here, finish Thane, commit. Make sure he's dead, now run. Some people might get hit by a fist stack. Big heals on, on Vilexi. Vilexi. Big, big. I'm milling healer. It's okay. Okay, there we go, now I got two now. Papa's here. Alright, third stack on Alexi. Make sure we're getting our second rotations going. Domber, can you go Blamo when Screech hits three? Alright, check on swapping off. And go. Screech, you will come low grain when I hit me. Stay spread, casters. So. I'll come take Blamo off you. I got Blamo right now. Okay. I will stay at the spot. Uh, is Andrin still at Zelic? I think he left, no. Okay. Go ahead and come in, Scrooge. He's got him. Scrooge up. I'm going to come Blamo. Zelic, Sun, Jazz. Andrin. Jazz, Jazz, Jazz. Andrin, when Scrooge hits three, you'll go Mograin, I think. Dumber, you will wait. Here we go. Ball, I got it. Okay. Yep. Uh, Vilexi, after after Andrin hits, uh, can you go Mugrain again? Yep. I've got four seconds on the Mugrain marks. Vilexi's go headed back into Mugrain. Free wherever anybody needs me. Uh, I'm free for anything either. Too. I've got Mograine. Uh, I want it Blamo. Go ahead and come down here. If you're clear on Blamo. No, I got four stats. Okay. I'm coming. Uh, I'm coming. Stadium's coming. Dumber, can you go with uh, Zelic? I'll go Zelic. Yes, please and thank you. Build wall of data, Mograine. Twinkle, just twinkle, pop everything over there. Just pop everything over there. Go to the corner as soon as you can. I got as soon as you got that taunt, buddy. Alright, Thadium has Blamona. Mograin stood. Yep, finish Mograin. Good job. And now we just take it slow. Do your safe spots. Domber, I'm coming as a Zelic. Yes, we can go Blamona. Zelix about to get his first wall, he resisted my first taunt. Good to go. Unless he resists again. Watch the void zone. Be unfortunate. He resisted again, Domberg, come back to me. Oh no, man, we're good to work over here. I'm free for Zelic if you need. I go, Zelic. Uh. Domber will, or Thadium will come in, yes, on Zelic, and then Domber you'll go Blumo. I know a lot of people are just AFK right now, but I'd rather just wait and hold buffs for Saf as much as we can. Looks like it's dead. Okay. Good. And we're just chilling. Watch, we're just watch waiting. The chaining on uh, Zelic, please. Just spread out. Be safe. Yeah, when one of the healers swap range, off yeah. Zelic, I'll go in. Coming up on three stacks. Scrooge, you'll go in when he hits three. All right, check. I'll swap with you. Give Scrooge a path in, guys. <laughs> Don't everybody rush in at one. Scrooge, both clears. Yeah, let let people trickle in. Don't all go at the same time. Uh, that will be Domber coming in next. Domber, you can go ahead and start in as soon as you hit three. Go. Don't forget the debuff. Ticked. Can I get a healer relief? OV too close. Any healer? 
Do you have Nephi coming in? And Fashley. After Domber, I'll head in. Jekyll's got 10 seconds left, and I can come in. in yeah boss is dead I'm just staying out all right let's get some uh, reses for the two dead and I got remember, the lots of frosters this gear we have uh, significantly less healers I actually uh, firing an air if you guys wouldn't mind playing in healers for staff I would appreciate it double warrior rogue if you want to as well. And yeah, everyone can pop a frost protection now. Alright, Lala and Tuco and Cash, go ahead and roll top two. What's the loot? It's double uh, warrior rogue and warmth of forgiveness. Alright, so the first one in Tuco, select major here. Second one's going to Lala. Nice. Uh, Frosters this gear, big, big, big. Thank you, Fire, for playing your priest. I don't think anybody needs this. Oh, it's really so garbage. It. Yeah. <laughs> uh, everyone, take a look. Make sure you remember the uh, saffron sheet. Uh, for healers that are here, I'm going to be putting them in the same spots for healers that uh, don't have a spot. I will tell you what group you're in and what mark to follow. But I'm going to take a few minutes here to just adjust groups so that it's the same as the other weeks. Air and Firen, thank you for bringing your healers for this boss. I appreciate it a lot. Sure, you actually equip your frost resistance gear. It doesn't work when it's in your bag. You have tech no. to speak. I'm doing it wrong the whole time. Is that, are you Irby's text to speech bone? You want to bring your pally? He's not a team. Okay. And I have no frost resist. Uh, we don't make our healers wear frost resist. It doesn't help. It hurts more than helps to have healers wear. But. I mean, I could log in on my warrior, but, you know. Nah, you're fine, buddy. I appreciate you being here. So, would it be triangle or tick? Um, I haven't set markers yet. Let me just delete them all. I'm still slowly putting the group together like an old man.
if you don't have a soul stone, now is the time. Or not soul stone, health stone. Oh, you can soul stone if you want. I already used it, dude. Damn it. Sorry, man. Was it worth it? Yes, it was, I think. Hopefully. We'll see. A uh, couple small differences we're going to have just because of people missing in groups. Uh, Pippi and Wallace, you guys are going to be with Fashley and his mark. So, star, okay? Got it. Uh, Pre-pop a shadow, please. Yeah, if you want. Not, not a shadow of frost is what I meant. And a shadow, I guess. Both are okay. Shadow's more important though. But yeah, the shadow can help with life drain. It saved me. Okay, I think I have all the marks on the right people. Once again, Pippi is with Fashion's group, correct? Uh, Fire and you're with Skull, by the way. Yeah, front left of the room, Pip. Thank yeah, you. Wallace, he will be after this boss. Alright, if you got a Frost Protection Potion popped, you got all your Frost Physics gear on, ready to go. Go ahead and hit me with the ready. Play it safe. Remember to refrost pot if you're looking low and scary. Help your healers out. We're running on 10. What's our kill time usually for this bus? Five, four, I want to say like three, a little over five minutes. Four, okay. Like best six is 454 is our best. So yeah, I, I would expect us to be a little over five today. Here. Thanks for the juju. Remember. Slow on threat to start. I'm fucking wearing all the tank gear in the world because holy fucks have pipes. Womp womp. Remember, mages, especially, you're quick on decurses on this boss. That is priority or anything else. You cut your cast, you decurse as soon as you see it. Don't stand in bad. Wizard. Twinkle, you're out of range. Air phase. Range 10. Spread out. First. Second, third, fourth, you're looking but not going yet, and go. Ooh. Give me a battle res on Mollus. Thank you. you, Scrooge, can, on you can you throw him in Innervate as well? Remember, keep healthy if you're getting low, frost pot. Otherwise, use them in air phases so you don't get chunked by a frost bolt. I 
mages, you're gonna look to decrease again here in a second. Should throw it out about three. How to move all up. And we're getting air phase here. Alright, spread, keep yourself safe. One, two, three. That one died though. Four. One more, and you're moving. Go, go, go. Rest in peace, young Domber. Yep. Remember, be curses, frost pots if you're low, keep yourself healthy. decreases here coming into sec yeah. and air phase coming soon should be our last air phase potentially yeah look where they are two Three, four, you got one on that side. Make sure you shift so you can reach it if you need to. Five, go. I would battle res Gumpy. Yes, give me a battle res on Gumpy, Nephi, if you can. Actually, he has That's amazingly one. lame. It's gonna go. Yeah. Um... Okay, good now. And give me damage cooldowns here. I just want to make sure we don't get another air phase. Curses, good. Watch out, guys. Berserk in 10 minutes. We might make it. <laughs> Yikes. I have to potentially move a little bit for Blizzard, so just watch the boss's positioning. Alright, despawn. Can you believe it? 10. We won't get it. Oh? Oh, she doesn't air first anymore? Oh, we did get it. Oh, if shit. you, if you push her oh, below 10, not? you're not supposed to. Keep us healthy. Keep us healthy. Spread. One. Two. Three, four, wait, go. Alright, finish the boss. I don't have anything to heal myself here. Good save, boys. Finish strong, finish healthy. Six minute, 28 seconds. Yeah, that was a long one because we got that extra air phase. Good deflection. Hell yeah, glyph of deflection.
Oh, this is open healers. Uh, Aaron, Firen, thank you again for popping your guys' healers for that thing. So it's going to Fashley, right? Ball's favorite shield. That is the trinket, sir. Again. <laughs> I suck. <laughs> you think it every time you see it. Yeah, it's open. Yeah, you seem very much behind an ice block, Wallace. Alright, uh, so healers, if you have your Bish shoulders, go ahead and just click uh, uh, Major. And it, you're not going to get charged for it, I'm just going to go by your roll in the add-on. Make sure to put on your normal gear. So far it looks like it's going to Rodin, the 93. I'll let the priest fight for it. Fight, fight, fight. Alright, congrats Rodin. Uh, and then the <laughs> stamina one we seem to get every week. Dude, we should sell that to uh, BG kids. That does sell for a lot. G kids. Alright, looks like it's going to Andrew with the 70. People use a different term that I didn't want to use. Alright, uh, number one priorities, guys. During mind controls leading up to it, turn off all your cleavy stuff. No pressing whirlwind, no blade flurry, no no none of that, okay? Obviously multi -shot. same goes. Yep, multi-shot, all that kind of stuff. And please, 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 when mind control happens, you do not press any damage buttons whatsoever. You let tanks get threat. When a tank is settled, and I call that that tank is the tank, the other tanks let him get the threat lead. And then we can go once that's established. Otherwise, you're just waiting. You're just CCing people. That's all you're doing. Just don't let mind controls run free and kill people. You guys don't need to do damage during mind controls at all, and we will kill this boss with plenty of time to spare. I'd really like to see us not get destroyed by mind controls and stuff this week. Everything is frost tombs are still a little messy. We lose a lot of people to them, even when we're not cleaving. So healers, make sure you keep an eye out. Make sure you're healing up our frost tombs and healing people before volleys. Could you please mark the melee? Uh, yeah. Thank you. Let's uh, not somehow Same pull 12 what did I normally give you? Uh, I forget. Was it triangle? Probably. I think it was. Thank you. I'm a star, I know that. Was yeah. it Lanigan I marked for a group or Nantuko? I usually mark Lanigan, not that it matters. Okay, Lanigan has a circle. I think I marked Freddy for the other one. Freddy, you have a diamond, congrats. Is there any, uh... Shine bright, buddy. Uh, the best. Any protection pots we need to pre-pot here? Uh, Frost. 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 Thank you. Oh, yeah. Put your normal gear back on. And, yes. Make sure you have your, your good dips gear. Remember, we killed this without world buffs. For wipe, it's not that big a deal. You just gotta so, deal with the mind controls right. Play patient on the ads. Don't let them go crazy. If for some reason you have Zanza's sheen on, take it off. Yes, please don't reflect polys when you're MC'd. I would fucking cry. I'm like fun. Yolo. Just, just let me talk during the, or the actual fight. And listen carefully. Line up in the door. We'll go as soon as this timer hits zero. Five, four, three, two, one. Go. 
Tumpies. I was eating as soon as you said that. He lost the yeah, like Thunder Fury. Uh, yeah. I'll be alright. Servants, soldiers of the cold dark, obey the call of Kel Thuzan. Remember melee, if you ain't got nothing to hit, help shoot stuff. I'll get first done. It'll help your parse, I swear, this part isn't excluded. Just don't I have, question it. I have Striker's Mark and Thorium Shells. It's gonna still be Just saying. Yeah, are you like flexing? Because that's basically a flex. Striker's Mark is a flex. Yeah, Striker's Mark is still pretty much biz. What the fuck? It's barely any different than shit you'll get out of the next. If you need hit, Striker's Mark is the go-to. A fucking rogue has Striker's Mark. I just coming. We'll get a quick Nimrubian Slave Maker. Dude, I think our hunters might shit themselves if they finally get one to drop. I don't think they need it. So neither of them soft reserve is an open roll, right? No. Oh. I'm just joking. It's it's going to hunters. Thinking? Warriors are not rolling on it. Or what about rogues? What? Oh. Hey. The fuck? Yeah, that's we a hard no that's a hard disallow for me. We said fucking people aren't allowed to roll on shit outside of their like. I suppose it would be like a hunter rolling on the sword off KT. Yeah, which they should be able to do. It's hunter gear. Isn't that everything one. Hunter gear though? Everything except wands. Thunder Fury, Biss, Hunter. That's a fan look a lot like a flask set piece, just saying. Mace is there, no go. Dude, I thought about it. And by thought about it, I mean I didn't at all. But, you know. I was gonna say developer, hello. Developer would be very upset with you, not optimizing. Not optimizing him. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll get next done. <laughs> How dare you hold the raid back? You could probably make like a clever bot style AI that talks like developer. You guys ready for me to play a warlock in DC? Hell yeah, brother. Are you yeah, I am so ready. You and every other warrior. Look, man. It's brain dead easy. And I can actually see what people are doing. The seed of corruption. So live, so link. Why, why play Warlock when you can like play Mage and do that Fire Shield, Spell Steal, and Gruul's Lair? Uh, because Warlock's brain dead, and I can just look at everyone. It's like the major classic. Look, I want to just tab target and press button. Okay. Uh, I got actually, I, I'm changing marks. Make sure you're hitting skull first and then X. So, quick question. Completely off topic. Is there a damage debuff on the four horsemen fight? No. no. They have a shield wall. Oh, okay, that's what it was. I'm wondering why you're hitting like a toothpick. It, yeah, I was like, why am I hitting for 90 damage? Hello? It's your lack of gear. Yeah, lack gear. Of gear. At 50% and 20%, they gain 75% damage. <laughs> oh my god. Unless you push them too fast. Push it to the limit. Oh. Well, on one side. Right, so if you push them too fast, they don't get the damage debuff. I got cool stunned.
X first, then square, then skull. Make sure we're keeping up on these skeletons though, so I'm gonna get a little, little dicey for me. What's wrong with the explosion? Uh, Thadium, can you grab the save bomb? Right damage. I wanna be able to... Yeah. Sit KT. It's like Actually, I think it's one more. One more and then... Yep, oh, that was it. Seconds. Skull and then unmarked Soul Weaver. Just don't get hit by Skellies here, please, God. He's out. You're waiting on KT damage, you're not doing anything right now. Alright. Let's get moving. Out of the figure. Job all moving back family. Alright, he can do mind control soon. He might not, but right now I don't want to see any cleaving. No whirlwinds, no multi shots. Blow your fears. Yes, please. Triangle group. Kill them all once. Alright. We're waiting. Let Domber get threat here or Scrooge. Please. Alright, Thadium has it. Give me a kick and let Thadium keep it. Scrooge, keep him alive. Good job on the CCs though. Uh, go ahead and give me a res on Thadium. And Your position, Melee. Melee, make sure you're... Max range, max range. Uh, if you got another frost pot, pop another frost pot. Because volleys are... And move a little bit to the right. Thank you. Man, look at these volleys. All right, he can either frost blast or mind control now. He did frost blast first. Heal those two. New battle area. Oh, we don't have any for holy so. All right. Just gotta keep going. He's mind controls out. Let me get the draft. Sinews in the back. I'm moving the boss a bit, so. Got to get another CC on Scrooge in two seconds. Do you have another blind? There's a few. Got yeah, Frost Tomb. Oof. Get oh, my PSA, my bad. Okay, though, just keep going. Fissure, he will, he will either do detonate first or don't go in. Okay. mind control. You know that melee group? I don't have them all in one group, I apologize. Detonate in melee. I require aid. Sees, send you in the back. CVs. Let Scrooge get threat. Let Scrooge get threat. We're keeping Scrooge up. Good job dodging the shadow fissure. Adds when you send the back. Cackles. First adds out. I way too close, man. <laughs> Keep Scrooge up through it. Second shackle there, and one more. All right, new ads that spawn. I'm going to grab new ads. We only shackle those three that are shackled. Star Circle Diamond, stay shackled, okay? That, that is our job here. Thadium, can you help grab that loose one? Not the one by the boss. Thank you. Cross Blast in the back. Melee, it's okay that this is here. Don't panic just because it's nearby. We're gonna get another MC soon. Can I get a, a fear or a shackle on that diamond? I'm just gonna grab it, never mind. Screw down. Blind. Pretty bone until. Alright, I have Kalthazad. 
I took one of them. Frostbite on Herbie. Uh. She's done. We're just tunneling KT with damage, guys. He already did the mind control, so you can go hard. We can get another MC again or a Frost Blast. Keep Thaddeum healthy, boys. Him to lay on hands or something, just keep him healthy. See his melee die, it's okay. No, we're low on mana. Daddy, I'm gonna take one of these off you. No, oh, I'm gonna go get that one, I guess. You should walk. Kick. I overlapped there. There's gonna be an MC. Ooh, good luck. It's a kill boss or die situation. Yeah. If we can survive this MC, you can kill. Bop. But... Rip. Close. We'll go again. Oh, dang. Do all the Almost a one shot. <laughs> oh no, some gave KT wisdom. Better watch out. Just a bit outside. Sorry, I tried to throw on a shield and hold him, but yeah, no, it didn't happen. Some frost no, blast. No, you, you cannot pot frost blast. Some frost blasts in their entirety just receive no heals. It it's gotta just get healed. On which the target? If you get four melee, get it. So no, I mean, die. I mean, like frost blast went out. Every target that was frost blasted got no heals. Yeah, cause I got frost blasted by himself and just died to it. No healing. Stan only barely died to his. He got a heal, it just wasn't enough. It should just be you guys throw one big heal on them quick and they live that. And then you can recover them before the volley. I think all the mind controls turned on me and put everything they could on me. One of the healers got melee and detonated. Yep. And melee, your first priority whenever you start doing damage again is not doing damage. Make sure you are max range and in your spot first. Like, not gonna cleave another group. Always, 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 just prioritize control. Should probably take off flash key. Mm 
mages should definitely pre pot at least because you have to use mana pots in phase one. Or at least we should. We need to pre-pot for mana, because we need to use mana pots in phase one. For me, it's okay, because like, I'm not taking frost damage from anything until KT. But that's great, but like, regardless, everyone should just fucking pre-pot, there's no reason not to. I don't want to hear like, all this you don't need to crap, it doesn't matter. It, it does not matter. Just pre-pot it. Everyone hit ready. We'll go on that. Nice and close. Remember, mind controls you're just waiting. So you're CCing the mind controls. That's all you gotta do. Healers, frost blast, absolute priority. Oh no, seven to eight gold. I'll get the first A-bomb. Okay. I'll get the next when we wipe fire and the raid as a whole loses like close to a thousand gold, right? Even if no one frost spots. Getting the next Tosh. Ranged, you got a skull. It does, uh, it does more damage than Fireball. Yeah, it's just not worth the cast time, Smile. Mm -hmm. Less DPS, more damage. Okay, next Tosh. Close to that. Mm -hmm. Skelly there. Hey, whoa, 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 Domber, buddy. Let's back it up and let it come in, man. Watch the skeleton. Yeah, I was a little too eager. 
Thank you, friend. Big Hodge coming. Should never leave the octagon. Any further than that, and I'm gonna yell at you. He's gonna go Joe Rogan on you. Dana White, please! Skull first, then X. Under Fury's on? Oh, yeah, it is. It tried to go whoosh. You afraid of pulling with that thing? Oh, yeah, it'll whoosh all the way into a cubby. Ooh, it has done it before. <laughs> Are we behind on skellies? After X, skull. Kinda. I'll hodge this. Melee in between eight bombs. Give a shot to all oh, a skelly real quick. Just pick one and shoot. Just catch us up. Can't shoot bullets with striker's mark. <coughs> I'll resist it. Don't die. I called my... <laughs> no, it's not gonna help. <laughs> I was eating a pretzel. My bow skill is like nothing. So you need a wheelbarrow for all those excuses? I mean, if you got one. Finish X, then skull, then square. Get your up, boys. We're looking a little, a little spooky. I'm trying! Skellies are staring me. More than anything, Skellies right now. Like, melee. Stunning. Shoot him. Just don't let him hit. Three weavers. Daddyum, you have aggro on this A-bomb, buddy. Don't die to it. Okay. Oh no. Please watch the weavers. Finish ads right now. Um, I just want to hold it. We'll wait. There you go, man. First mind control, stop. Stop, 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 stop. Let's screw you to get it. Continue DPS on Weavers. Yes, ads first. Maybe reposition. Send shift a little bit. Good job on that one, boys. Remember, make sure you are max range. Someone running exposed armor? Yes, I see it. Back up. Alright. Whoever the fuck decided to go expose armor is like risk of not coming back to this fucking raid. Do not fucking cast expose armor again. Uh, sorry, Colt. All right, we lost Scrooge. Was that a kick? Yep. Yeah, frostbolts. Dumber, if you got anything to live, buddy, pop. Oof. Lala has it. I'm gonna save Battle Res as this pull though, because uh, we're feeling a little scuffed. Mind control can happen at any point. This is killable though. When we get an MC, please let uh, Andern try to get threat. Hopefully he's not picked, and healers, make sure we tunnel Andern. All we're doing is CC and kick stirring. Your soul 
There's my control. Ignite is a bitch. Can Herbie get a decurse? We're gonna go ahead and just wipe this pool. Everybody stay in the middle. Get a volley or whatever. Void zone on top of us. Detonate, whatever. Just stack right in nice and close. Stop. Don't try to like run around and waste time and save buffs and shit, please. What the hell is this thing doing in my raid group? I was gonna say, now that we have sheep in the raid, is, are we lambs to the slaughter? Beep, 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 beep. Just for my own clarification, did Scrooge die and that's why I had aggro or did I pull aggro? Scrooge died. Okay, just making sure. The yeah, a, a oh. nice old collective group of kick missed kick. Wasn't wasn't throwing blame around, just asking. No, I was mimicking the keyboard cat theme that I have set up to my wipe sounds. I'm gonna just post this again in case we need it. Make sure you have yourself remembering which kick group you are. If you need the weak aura, you should have the weak aura. Uh, question I have um, DBM is being stupid and it's showing for like a list of people with corrupted mind. How can I get rid of that? Right click it and go down to hide. Or slash reload, maybe? Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Frosty is my peeps. Frost pot. So I'm gonna be that guy. Uh huh. I didn't come prepared. Yeah, I'm out of frost pots because I use like a bunch on that one. Oh no, that's not what I'm talking about. Anyone ever repair bot? Yep. Thank you, sir. Don't mean to drop one since I placed it oh, on the thank phone. you. We can let Rap drop the one first. All these uh, kind people. They're really cheap right now for some reason. Triangle. Oh, yeah. I shall make more and replace them. Just open mic. I definitely have uh, the Rona. I took the frost pot and it didn't taste cold at all. Oh shit. Mm. Kind of looks like it would taste like Gatorade, you know? No, I don't. Well, now you know. Good. Sin that doesn't matter. Where they casted right. it, just overrates. Yeah. Please, no press expose. I thought uh, only improved expose can overwrite to. It only things. looks like. Oh, he's the only one that hasn't repaired. If Sunder isn't at 5 and someone presses expose, expose will overwrite. Oh, okay, good. <laughs> Which Sunder dropped during the mind control and, uh, and expose went up. Yep.
Let's finish it out, boys. CDs near me. Alright, CDs. I'm gonna assume you're good. I see you moving around. We're going on that. Let's go. Colt, you there, bud? I'll get next done. Hand it over, Neffy. Oh. What's the cooldown on the rate? Five minutes, I think. That's a nice weird number. Six is a weird number, man. Better than eight. Whatever happens in sixes. Seven. Abdominal muscles. True. Uh, yeah, and those are weird. Cans of beverages. Those are also weird. Have you guys ever seen the ingenious design of the aluminum beverage can? Yes. Mm -hmm. It could Six have been square. Suction. It's actually a beautiful YouTube video. Mm -hmm. That definitely masterpiece. YouTube video ever. I'm so glad so many people know about it. If you don't know about it, I highly recommend watching it. It's entertaining and uh, a good little bit of knowledge going for no reason at all, other than it's informative. And knowledge is power. And knowing is half the battle. Oh, yeah. G.I. Joe. I'll get next time. Take that, screwed. Ah, shit! Here we. We had this whole speech earlier. At least it only pulled scalies. About multi shot. The skeleton, the skeleton. We lectured him about it, he just forgets. Melee help out with skeletons. I'll get next done. FG 
you guys finish that unmarked one, Skull is next. And then it'll be X. Pop some damage cooldowns if you got them, casters. Just keep us going on these good after X, new skull. Skull fish, then X. I'll get X done. After X, you'll do square. It's done. Screech, can you grab this one? Guys, right, careful, Jesus. skellies. You guys really need to turn on nameplates. They're running right into us, careful. 15 seconds. Alright, this is the last day bomb. Can you grab this? So I am free. Wallace, you're a brave man. No, I shouldn't have done that. Standing that close. It's all good. Alright, man, you're good to go. Make sure you're in a good spot. First MC's. match till early. Scrooge is also MC. Let Domber get it, please. Or Thadium. <laughs> Domber has it. Keep Domber up. Feared. What? Just, you're just waiting on damage right now. You're just CCing. Let Domber build a lead. Make sure we get kicks. Alright. We're keeping Domber healthy. Melee that are normally in Domber's group stand on star. Freddy. Yeah. Me, buddy. Or don't. Cool. You want me to get anyone up? Mm, depends on how soon the mind control is. Go ahead and get Andrew up. And, uh, then if you get Thumber. Let me move him back here. You guys don't need to be worrying about anything right now. You can start DPSing, but careful of mind control, because it's can happen again soon. And he is fucking being a bitch about me moving back. There it is, you're waiting, so let Scrooge get it. No? We just go? Where'd Scrooge go? Nah, you just... He drops to it. I he mean, it, if I say a name, that person just keeps going. Alright? Yeah, we wait till we repositions. Probably. We're pretty dead, so... Oh. Go ahead and just wait. <sighs> like... You guys aren't right-clicking nothing after MC. You just wait. I say that person goes, that person goes, everyone else is just... Fit twiddle your thumbs. Deal with mind controls, and then when I say go, you can go again. <laughs> I'm uh like you guys should be canceling casts and everything. Squash by fall. Nothing should be touching that boss as soon as the mind control starts. Mage Ignite, I know it can get a little fucky, but we just need to bop whoever has the Ignite. That doesn't... Mm. Well, I mean, the Ignite will drop after, if you guys are just standing there pollying. Not but it'll, it should give enough time. If you bop someone that has threat, you're just gonna frostbolt them. 
Okay. I'm gonna be honest, I'd rather that happen than the boss go flying everywhere. Ignite is an abomination against God. <laughs> Is that Frostbolt not still kickable, Rep? I mean, it just seems like... If you need to bop, you've already lost. If that... So when you MCs, I know you reset threat. That one tick of Ignite, is that when it pulls off? It depends yeah. on how big the Ignite is, but yeah. Okay. Cause I, that's like, I guess our biggest problem is as soon as MC happens, you re reset threat, and it like repositions melee, and then they can't kick, and they just start trickling down. That's why we stop DPSing a while before MC. I just, I hope everyone understands about that. When MC happens, he resets threat. And sweet sneaking in here now too. The bot is not still here. Yes, sir. You need that big wand damage sweet. Yeah, the, the, the way this will go down, the way it's gone down, is the MC will start. No one's touching except for the tanks that I want to be building threat. So Thadium, Scrooge, and Undomber. You guys will be building threat right after the MC cast. That's your priority. And as soon as I see a tank that's not mind controlled, I'm going to call that one. And the other tanks that I don't call, you guys stop and let that one get a threat lead. I'm always going to prioritize Scrooge over anyone else and then Thadium. But if we're lucky, the whole fight should only bounce between me and Scrooge. Because neither of us will get MC'd on the same ones where the tank gets MC'd. Sure, you got your buffs up. Consumed and good to go. Angelis, you good? <clears throat> yes, it's fine. 
here, hang on. I'm gonna buff real quick. Okay. I'll do that. Um. Yeah, nephew. But yeah, you can give it to someone besides me. You can give it to me if you want, nephew. I carry you to that staff, I'm not even in your group. I don't do groups in this raid. Oh, sweet, I take you. Four, You're mine. Three, two, one. Let's go. Front of the pack stopped for like a half second. There you go. No thunder for you, wishes this time. I remembered. I mean, sweet. This looks fresh to me. Everything just spawned. It's so fresh. I'll get next done. I'll get next Tosh. Casters, I think you can be damaging, yeah, like damage cooldowns. I'll get next hush. Oi! 
get. It's okay, we can grab your health slow, you don't need to like, people, blow a bunch of mana. People not using nameplates, so they don't see it. Okay, resisted it. Got another way, but I'm fine. Skull first, then square range. Um, not grabbing that aim, I'm so someone careful. So, um... I'll hodge it. Skull and square the next. Square first, square first. Move into your spots. He's fucking really being a dick with his movement right now. Alright. Remember, mind control can be early. There's a fissure. He'll either mind control or volley next. Or blast. One of the three. It's volley. Apply their mind control for blast next. Blast first, steal Lala, because I got frozen. Good job. Very good job, you saved all the melee there. Probably mind controller volley next. Mind control, let Scrooge get it. Keep Scrooge up. Make, don't miss kicks and me, deal with MCs. That's it. Get on diamond. Up Get on diamond. Scrooge, I think you can back up like one step. And you shouldn't. Alright, well, never mind. Reposition around me, please. Range 10. Yep. Make sure we're not going to freeze Scrooge. That's number one priority, man. It's like nine people, in my thing. Just back up. Domber. Should be right inside everybody else, buddy. I smash you back up like two steps. If you stand on triangle, you're good. Just keep backing up, smash. Just back up. Alright, we'll either get another blast or an MC. Next. It's blast. That's mana. Never mind. Batty and Sin. Blaster MC. Blaster MC. Your soul. MC. Let Lala get it. Sin, you in the bear? You're just CCing. You're just CCing. Yeah, someone needs to get screwed. Blinds for the bear. Or gouge. I can just tank you, honestly. Alright. Just don't miss kicks Fires. now. Back to your spots. Warriors, if you haven't blown your fear. If you guys have a frost potion or something, pop it. Because we're all kind of oof on health. I'm dead if we do Alright. We'll get a mana first, I think, and then it can be blast. It won't be blast, it'll be volley or mind control first, after this. We're getting shackles now. Keep an eye out where they're spawning. I will mark them Skullic Square for shackle. The unmarked will get tanked by Thadium. Skulls out. You're just holding for mind controls, guys. No reason to go ham. Just make sure we don't miss kicks. Shackle X, Shackle X. 
please. Give me shackles or paladin fears on them. Thadium, you're picking up those new ones now. The one out there that's unmarked. Bandage guys, we're desperate for heals. Uh, Yutari, battle is uh, Nephi for me. And yes, please bandage. We're still waiting on a mind control that can happen. <laughs> Go ahead and pop damage cooldowns, just no blade flurry or whirlwinds and stuff. Kill the boss. Any health stones or pots you have? Three shackles, three shackles. Yeah, please, please, please. Get on diamond. Hear it, anything. Alright, I'm on, I'll just tank it, dude. Cross blast. Just gonna be an MC, just max DPS right now. Yep. All you're trying to do is kill. It's on screw. Any cooldowns you got, pop them and live. Paladin, if you got bubs, get ready. Kill this motherfucker. Good job. <laughs> yeah, it's a job. Yeah, it worked. Hey, it All right. Ooh, that's really nice loot, though. Hey, it's a new record. I don't see it. We got a uh, healer mace. Hey, the thing. Oh, hey, uh, slave, slave, maker. slave maker. You got my soft reserve on that mace, right? Hmm. Congrats uh, to a oh, hunter. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, sweet. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. It's very nice of you to soft reserve it for one of the other healers, sweet. <laughs> Alright, ring of faith then. That's fine. I make jokes about that being warrior loot, but for real, congrats on whoever gets that hunters. Uh after loot goes out, hang around for a bit. We're gonna have a little guild power. I got some talking to do. Oh. Alright, uh, Nephi and Rodin, go ahead and roll. I'll try to get rid as soon as I can. Alright, thanks guys. <laughs> Thank you, sweet, for coming. That's no problem. Nephi, go ahead and click Major. Slave Major looks like it's right out of, like, Turok or something. What's that? A dinosaur game? Yeah. Mm. Dinosaur hunter. Hunters. And it's not even a warrior troll roll. Dang. Uh, the respect that I put on that. You cleaned up tonight, man. Damn, that's a hundred and three. Jeez. He didn't get his corrupted <laughs> ash bringer though. Congrats, sir. He got pants in him. Oh. This is this is open. This is also open. Thank you for coming. Looks like Domber's the highest roll. Yep, and diddly Dieterino. Alright, I'll do a timer. I'll do the bidding on the KD trinket. Jeez. Oh, that's not five minutes, but I screwed that up. Yeah, I just bid. Sweet bid, five gold. I think Scrooge that was 5k. started it at 3k. Yeah, it's it's that 3k on Scrooge. Everyone's already lining up. Gimme, gimme. Hey, fear in. Shot delay. Yo, Sin, no, dude. <laughs> Wait, it's like the summon order from uh, today. I always think it goes up, not down, buddy. Oh, darn. I like it's not death to do, though. Are you really using Gressel in a fucking Warblade? Yeah. 
the hell is wrong with you? Freddy has uh, a bliss. <laughs> Nobody else? I'm gonna close it then. Alright, Grant Scourge, click major there. Tumpies, did you mean to wear frost dress pants? Yeah. I've partially resisted some frost bolts that have saved me. You, uh, you can't partially resist the frost bolt on the Sorry, not partially. Fully resist, but I know it's binary. So it saved you. me. You just get, I guess I can hand it out to <laughs> I mean, you can check the healing. The healing's fine with that. Yeah. Alright, so up here with me. Let's see, we have what? What do we have? Thirty-eight. Looks like Are we yeah. counting sweet? Yeah, he's here. He was here for it. All right. So it looks like seventy-eight gold piece. Nice. Are we counting sweet? We're, We're counting sweet. Count We're counting sweet. We don't have to if you don't want. Well, I like him. Think about it. Sweet, uh, does your warrior have Gressel? Uh, oh, never get that. Uh, well, well, while we're getting our, our loot here, I'll, I'll get started talking. Uh, long story short, I have long term plans. I want to start etching out. Obviously, we don't know when a fucking BC release date is, or if it's even happening, or how it's even happening, and all that kind of stuff, right? But I want BC to happen. Um, some of you saw today while you were on earlier, if you're on it like. I don't know, like 4 o'clock, I am leveling a Warlock, and that is because I'm going to re-roll Come Burning Crusade to arrange DPS so I can actually just see shit and brain dead not have to pay attention to my character and just call things for everybody. Uh, because when you're tanking, it's impossible to see shit either through the boss's nutsack because it's huge and in your face, or because you actually have to be paying attention to so much more than you do uh, for your personal self than you do as a ranged. So. I'm leveling a warlock for BC. That's whatever. That's long term. Uh, in the meantime, uh, as you can see, we are uh, struggling to fill our raids each week. Currently, um, it's been a point for a while now that pretty much Kosa has been the only one doing like hard recruitment since you know partway through AQ. Uh, pretty much since he came back, and even slightly before he came back, he was still recruiting people for us. Um, but, uh, Irby has been helping out for the past couple weeks. Beyond that, like, it's been hard to find people. Uh, you know, we're, we're a 15 of a 15 guild, but we're not like a super fast player guild or anything like that. So it's really hard to find people that we, we want to like bring in that will, will fit in well with the environment we have here. Uh, both of us, myself and Koso, are extremely burned out on trying to uh, coordinate filling the raid every week, especially with new people coming and going constantly and a big revolving door. Uh, and that revolving door is not stopping. We have quite a few other people that are on their way out on the horizon that we need to fill for and it's, you know, obviously only putting us further behind. Um, I have obviously for a long time talked about how much I hate being in leadership and not just playing the game but I am at the point where I know I'm just going to do it because that's what I want to do for the guild kind of thing that's part of the reason I'm talking about rolling a warlock in PC and why I'm leveling it um, but I do want other leadership I want I want people that want to play the game a lot that want to make the guild successful a lot and are willing to spend time to do it because it takes time it's a lot of work i'm not going to pretend it's not but we need people who want to recruit right now uh to step up and be in a position to recruit that is more than anything the big thing we need um come bc i may want people to divert some other tasks down like uh strats and stuff like that or making the rt notes and that kind of stuff but for the most part i will always be the guy that in raid has the voice and is saying hey let's do this thing at this time watch for this thing that kind of stuff if we don't have like any sort of uh big you know 
step up or anything like that. Uh, next couple weeks, we're probably going to be running like 30 people tops in our raids. And while I don't mind us just, you know, killing what we can kill with 30 people for the time being, uh, there will be a point for sure where we'll be calling at least a break until Burning Crusade or something. Um, I'm not upset at that. We, we know the raid size is going to shrink in BC, and obviously we can't accommodate 40 people. And I know a lot of people say, you know, recruit up to 50 and all that kind of stuff. But I I'm, I don't think that's possible realistically to make a 50 raider squad for two raid groups that will actually functionally clear well with two raid groups. So we're doing one group come BC. Uh, as for the roster that I'm waiting until BC dates announced, I'll put out a poll, check everyone that's interested, uh, and we will make a roster based on that. If people don't want to do BC or whatever, that's fine. If people want to go on, hell yeah, I'm super fucking down. But that's all way off, right? In the meantime, let's focus on now. We're probably clearing light. We're probably not clearing 15 out of 15 here in a while. If we don't have recruitments, the big things we're looking at right now is down the line. We need to fill some healer holes again. Uh, and we need, honestly, as long as our tanking situation is good, any DPS. I'm fine with any DPS. Uh, as long as they do decent damage. I don't want to just pull in people who are super undergeared and not, you know, paying attention to what's going on. Well, we're running dist. We I'm did kidding, dissed. it's a joke. <laughs> <laughs> this is doing all right. Yeah, yeah. It, it's his first time in the raid. He hasn't seen a lot of this stuff, and we kind of did just throw him in. He did good. Yeah, yeah. Good job, this. Wasn't that your first KT also? Yeah. Yeah, there you go. Good job. Uh, but yeah, that's the situation as it stands. I This is an open powwow at this point, pretty much. I, if you guys have suggestions, things like that for how we're doing stuff, like I am super down uh, for hearing what you guys have to offer. Yo, I, I play this game 25 hours a day. I'll start recruiting people. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if it's a party, can I do what I normally do in parties? Just leave. <laughs> uh, I guess. I'm just if kidding, I'll say voice for now. If you don't have anything you feel like you really want to contribute, at, at this point you guys can go ahead and go. I've said my, my piece as far as what's going to go on in the near future and down the road. But down the road, I am fully committed to making something happen in BZ. One way or another, I will make a roster for that. Um, I have a question. So when you say one group, are you talking about a 25-man group? or? Yes, I will have a roster of about 30. Uh, we'll have to rotate some people on fights and stuff like that. Not everyone will be in for every single fight, but my goal is to have a roster of 30 for Burning Crusade because that is something where you want to have a little wiggle room. You don't want to be running undermanned like we do right now where we have five people out, right? So we'll have a little bit of bench room. Do you need uh, a lot of max gear to progress to TBC? No. Oh, no, hell no. You could be fresh green geared and go to BC just fine. Because the reason why I say that is, you know, I it's tough without a date, but it was it's almost like, and I know this will piss a lot of people off, but it's an open power, so suck it. But we could, you know, if we knew it was coming out April second, we could take a two month break. Yep, and that is something that Koso and I have talked about is whether or not the guild will just have to take a break at some point. Like I said, with our roster slimming and slimming pretty much week by week at this point, <laughs> it's an inevitable thing. Because, uh, I mean, you guys, you know, like, I don't know, I, I've been here longer than, you know, almost everybody. Uh, but, you know, even if some people left the guild, to go to another guild to raid for two more months uh, you know I kind of have a feeling you know you guys you guys run a good ship so I'm surprised if a lot of people came back if they joined other guilds in the meantime yeah 
I mean, BC will be a bit of a different environment too, because it'll be much more of a, we gotta have people really step up performance wise here and there, because you can't just AFK or like be super as, you know, I don't want to say not attentive, people are trying, but there there is a step up in difficulty and I do want to match that. I want us to keep clearing, even if Nax was bumpy and it took us, you know, a month or so. I want us to keep that pace in Burning Crusade, which means if stuff's harder, we got to get better. And if that means if I have to recruit better people, even if we have people already, I will recruit better people. I mean, do you do you still keep in contact with, you know, Oz comes to mind, right? The guy who just kind of got burnt out. One day. Uh, like yeah, like Singer and like them. I still talk to them once in a while. I wouldn't say I've I mean, like they... approached them about Burning they... Crusade or anything, no. Yeah, are they I, coming? And I can. Are, are they thinking about coming back for TBC? I don't really know. The the subject's never really been like the topic of conversation lately. And that's part of the reason I bring this up is you know ideas to come out so that I can work with more stuff. So, quick question. Um, in yeah. layman's terms, what is your guild's process to recruit new folks, and how can we help you to get you know, more folks into the guild? Uh, ideally, pretty much the first thing is, you know, you're looking for what we need to, to fill slots right now, so we're looking for DPS, I'm okay with any variety, and I'm looking for healers, probably one druid, and beyond that, either a priest or a paladin, I'm open to anything. Uh, so basically, maybe even other spam in channel and have them, you know, speak to yeah. one of you folks, the officers, or ideally, the way it would work is you spam in channel. If someone messages you, the first thing you will always ask for is logs of some kind, whether it's from an alt of, or like if they're on an alt and that they're wanting to play instead, and they can link logs of their main or whether that's their character and they have logs of it. You want logs. If you get logs and you're not sure how to deal with logs and stuff, send me logs, tell them you're gonna have an officer look at it and tell them that you'll get uh, you'll get someone to reach out to you or you will reach back out to them when you get an answer from officers. But that is the number one thing. If you're not comfortable looking at logs and you can't tell, you know, what makes a good raider and not, that's fine. Looking at logs is kind of complicated. You can't just look at a parse and be like, yeah, it's a good player. I mean, to some degree you can if it's really, really high all the time, but at the same point, not necessarily. But that's it. If you are, if you are recruiting, you're asking people, for logs and then if you can look at them and determine if they're a good player you can t tell us officers hey i found this good person i think i want to offer them a trial ideally we respond back pretty quickly boom yeah i mean the there first couple things you want to make sure on is that they're going to be available for you know monday wednesday night raids. yeah i mean ideally that's in the you know whatever you're spamming and then they're not brain dead and see that That'd be a nice uh, flag one for if they ask you, you know, when do you guys raid when you have it in your spam? That's probably a step one, and they're probably not that attentive. Well, are you anticipating the raiding schedule changing? I would very much prefer it stay the exact same. Um, I don't want i can't really afford to like add days or something because i also raid two days in retail and thankfully retail is very low commitment i can literally just raid log and that's not a big deal uh but as far as it goes here i i am probably going to you know when uh bc rolls around beforehand start kicking up a bunch of dust and effort to get things moving to make sure we're good for bc Uh, sign up for Wednesday. Hell yeah, what Fashley said. Make sure we have people for next week. Lala, are we sign, sign up for Wednesday, Wednesday Lala? Lala? For next week, or are we still doing the uh, soft reserve thing for the next couple weeks? Yep. Yep. We'll be doing that until we're done. 
the sheet is unlocked, you can go uh, put your stuff in. Do we have known losses for uh, like key positions, or were you just speaking like we might lose people? Nah, like like I said, right now the the people I know of that are leaving that have talked to me that we need to work on filling is a we are only running like 35 people anyways for the most part because we have empty DPS spots. Uh, but B, we are definitely missing, just to be comfy and not have, you know, only one healer druid in the whole raid, an extra healer druid, and uh, potentially extra paladins and priests. I just want healers in general. I don't really care too much about their class. I just want them to be a good player and that kind of shit. Right now, as it stands, our warrior situation is a lot better than it looked, you know, two or three weeks ago when we were panicking. Could you, like Andrew said, possibly post a message in one of the channels, probably right chat, so people can copy paste? Yeah. If possible. What? And yeah, what Irby said, he'll post it. He's been spamming, okay. and that'll work well. Thank you, Irby. Uh, but yeah, as I said earlier on, Koso and I have been super burnt out, but uh. I'm not burnt out on the game, I'm burnt out on the week to week, you know, struggling to make sure we're going to have a raid that can clear. We get that in order, uh, whether it's a group effort or whether, you know, I, I step someone up specifically to just be super heavy into recruitment and make them an officer. I'm fine with that, but. It uh, needs to happen. Have we considered making an alliance with another guild for the last couple months of the game? Um, the only reason I'm ever hesitant to do that is A, there's pretty much always some drama involved. I would rather hold out until whatever guild we make, as, as rude as this sounds, I would rather hold out until whatever guild we would make an alliance with dies because they don't have enough people and absorb the players from them that we want slash need. That is that is Not honestly the healthier option. Yeah, we did that a few times. It's much easier too. Laser, I don't think that one's gonna happen, but they're <laughs> <laughs> just gonna go stir up some drama. But yeah, I, I really, I'm going to make a guild in Burning Crusade, whether it, it is mostly people from this guild and we're just, you know, steamrolling straight from Classic into BC, that'll happen, or whether I am making a fresh guild with new people, uh, that that's the plan. So, as soon as they have a release date announced from the fucking BlizzCon thing this year, that's coming in like two weeks. Which I assume is going to have the release date. Who knows? Maybe not. I'd be surprised though. Uh, I'll fucking throw up a poll. See who all's wanting to do Burning Crusade. See who doesn't want to do Burning Crusade. I'd appreciate everyone responding to that poll. Whether you're interested or not. So I know. And going from there. I'm interested. Yeah, Lala, thanks for carrying yeah, that one. Uh, are you planning on trying to fill the raid, though, with um, pugs like we have been? Um, until we, you know, can't get 35 plus in? Uh, I don't know. Hopefully the recruiting goes well enough that we don't have to. Yeah, I, I'd like to say recruiting goes well enough we don't have to. Or, uh, honestly, like, as much as it sucks... I'd almost say it's better for us to just take a break for a bit if people really, really, really want to raid, you know, whether GDKP is or officer runs are an option that you can wiggle yourself into. I, but I, I, I would think if we can't fill that breaking might be the better play. So bringing in Pugs has, I mean, for the most part, you know, Sweet has come in, Chef came in tonight without expecting anything. Um, if we bring in too many pugs, they're going to expect us off reserve, and 
that doesn't always go well with people losing out on gear to a bug. Um, so that's something we'd actually have to you'll have to be okay with, and it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen a decent amount. Okay, that makes sense. I just, uh, you know, I was trying to uh, temper expectations going forward if uh, if we're looking to you know, take down um, KT in the next couple of weeks. My ideal situation would be that we still kill KT every week. Uh, again, that's ideal, not necessarily what might happen. Yes. So I'm guessing that we've got some people that have already decided that they're kind of done. Uh, yep. Whether they've left in the past couple of weeks or are leaving in the next week or two, yes. We, we do have quite a number of people that have said they are done. As you can tell, some people okay. didn't even necessarily say they were done. They just disappeared on us in the past couple of weeks. Like, uh... I think it was rap or somebody joked about we killed KT and the credits rolled and they were out. Um, that was me. I made a joke about that. And, well, yeah. Good job, Tinko. I like that joke. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I will be here until we break or, you know, whatever we decide to do. And I'd, I'd like to continue in the TBC. TBC is kind of, that's, that's my jam. So, someone did mention the dreaded GD GDKPs. Um, when will we know if... Um, if we're breaking? Yeah. I would try to let everyone know at least a week in advance. Basically, the first week we have really rough roster looking situation. And we're just, you know... Not going to be able to clear everything, obviously, because we're running like exactly 30 people or or not even. That's when I'd be like, all right, this is break time. Yeah, there's nothing like that war of attrition that we dealt with that me and me and Jazz and Nephi and those of us from OWO dealt with with uh, with OWO um, with <laughs> roster situations. You just you just bleed members. Yeah, the, the revolving door gets big. And uh, as much as I've been trying to stop it from spinning so fast, it's been rough. Oh, I can imagine. I've been trying to help out. I've, I've got friends that are in guilds that are not clearing that I've, you know, not necessarily been trying to poach, but been talking to. And... Yeah, we'll see. Yeah, where is Lucy? Uh, still with Devon Brutality. Uh, they actually cleared tonight I believe wait is there is mini raiding with us I used to be in that guild the Vine of Brutality who's mini daddy I'm I'm pretty sure there's a few of us that have um that have raided together we've raided with MCST back in the day and me and Andern and there's a few of us here that know each other from way back your replacement I don't know who you were with, Adam, but I, I remember. I remember. Yeah, I don't. I don't know if that's a joke or what. Open. Yeah, I, I st actually started with a very, very, very small guild. Um, who were like laughable, and um, divine brutality. They came to us, and they were very um, short on members. And um, MC was about to come out, and they were panicking because they. It. So we kind of joined forces together, and that's how it's the divine brutality really got started. Um, uh, with MC uh, joining, they would, you know, we joined guilds, and I ro I rolled with them. Be, be let's say MC and most of BWL. And right before AQ came out is when I parted ways. Yeah, the the shitty thing is that. Uh it's good and bad is that every other guild is doing this too like every other guild has people that killed kt and dipped yep. um and has people that are burning out so 
the every week that we last through it, we're going to see that pool of people that are looking for a guild that are competent players open up. So it really is just a matter of keeping it going, and it sucks. But there, there are going to be people that are there, and it's it's not necessarily. I've had more luck talking to people I know than I have just spamming the channels. So if you have people in guilds, you know, don't tell them, hey, your guild sucks, leave. But if you have someone whose guild has been on the ropes, I mean, you can let them know, hey, like. Getting 36, 37 people to raid at this stage in the game is, is that's an achievement, and, and we're still doing that, despite how annoying it's been recruiting, so we could be a target for a lot of those players. Well, we're kind of quiet. A lot of people don't even know that we exist all that much. I mean, yeah. When you say, oh, well, we're in the top, we're in the top 30 guilds on the server, people are like, oh, who are you? Changing and I think a lot like of that is because... Didn't help. We don't have any fucking drama. Yeah. Doing a lot of our fun. recruitment, a lot of our recruitment is word of mouth. So I didn't get picked up from a recruitment message. Neither did any of the friends that I have here that came that came with me. Yeah. Um, we came. I got whispered through Discord. I was on Netherwind. I posted recruitment in Pagel. Yeah, the the spamming definitely helps doing it in, in LFG chat or whatever, but. uh also, you see people that you know in other guilds, you talk to them, chances are someone's going to want to join. But yeah, I'll, I'll keep my ear, I'll keep my ear out, and if uh, if any of the folks that I know that are still playing wants to, wants to come aboard, I'll, uh, I guess, get some logs and stuff together for you. Well, guys, I'm going to go uh, not taste my food and uh, try not to poop my pants anymore. Uh, yeah, I hope you feel better <laughs> since Wednesday. Oh, shit. Good luck, keep, man. Keep yourself, you know, healthy and... Look, man, I'm Stay I'm fat. hydrated. I'm, get good sleep. I'm fat. I drink, like, three gallons of Diet Mountain Dew a day, so I'm well hydrated and very well <laughs> carbonated. Uh, I think I'll be fine. I removed everyone's no, um, soft reserve from the sheet, so you have to re-add yours. Oh my so I god! For it forced to clear. So. Oh wow. Dude. Well, I mean, I'm I'm not trying to I'm not trying to brag or anything, but I got both of my soft reserve. So, do I get yeah, the yeah, soft lucky. reserve two more things, or should I just lay back? You get it. You can. Uh, we've talked about setting something up so that people who didn't get something, in in the last sets might have an advantage this set but we didn't break anything out i don't i'm honestly pretty lazy about it well so. i'm um i'm a very reasonable person whenever i talk about like taking like hunter weapons and stuff like that it's all a joke it's not serious so it's one of those things that i, I may not even do soft reserve i may just leave it alone and let some folks try to get some stuff because i got way too lucky no, dude, I, I mean, I think what you do is you you do it like it's normal, and if it comes down to it, and it's someone that you know hasn't gotten shit, you can you can pull the I'm not going to be a dick move, but we didn't we didn't put that in when we did right. it. Uh, the plan was you could do it every two weeks, and so, you know, do I, I would say think of it as a case-by-case -case basis, and don't just say I'm not going to put a reserve on there. Yeah, because we're still getting gear off EPGP. Yeah. Well, I will, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Feel Wednesday. better. See ya. Don't, don't shit your pants. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to. I, I know a lot of people left, but uh, I love everyone here. I think I've grown a lot this past year. Whether it's as like a pseudo leader for something or just as a person in general. And I appreciate it a lot, so. I love you too, Lala. Yeah, man, it's been fun. <laughs> Y'all are near and dear to my heart. Um. Never mind, I forgot what I was gonna say. Put the words out of his mouth. As much as I hate being made a leader, speechless. maybe that's what it takes. Oh no, I, I raided with Minikaru before. He's cool. Hey, Jazz. I assume that's why Laser signed up as a warrior. Yeah.
You like dead mines? I do like dead mines. Mini is a robot. Alright, y'all have a good night. Good night. See ya. Alright, time to bag my uh, nature is this gear. <laughs> Sell my bloodline stuff. I think, so. I think it's time to sell to vendor the bloodline set. Yes. <laughs> Man, how would you feel to hop on your warrior and just kill a bunch of those uh, guys in dead mines? If you know what they're called. Defias. <laughs> the, the correct answer is Defias. No. <laughs> so you yeah. says it sometimes. I'll be right back. Yeah, after I clean out my bags here, I'll go on. I'll quick do that. Oh, I'm like level seven. Oh, so I need yeah, a couple yeah. days. He... No, it'll be uh, about 10 minutes. It's, you're going to be level 15 or whatever you need to be? I think it it's like uh, 13. No, you can get in dead mines at 10. It's just a, a bitch to get down in there. Yeah. <laughs> it's going to be a pain in the ass. I can uh, stealth all the way there. Uh, you can't stealth until 20, Stan. Never mind. What is this game? What is this game? <laughs> 